Well, because of my attempt to draw <laughs> today, I'm not going to have much time to work on this clay. I'm going to do as much as I can. I want to get at least the body of the, the horse. I'm going to worry about the uh, lower legs and all that stuff uh, later. I want to get everything sketched in, and I'm going to work as quickly as I can today, and uh, I'll be right back. Time to play with some clay. A uh, friend of mine on Facebook sent me this wonderful little carving of a bird and it's supposed to be a stress reliever, reliever because you can hold it in your hand and it, it, it'll relieve your stress and boy am I stressed today <laughs> trying to do about two or three different things at once but uh, I still want to thank uh, her for making this for me and uh, sending it to me. Speaking of drawing, I just got a package of a hundred sheets of vellum paper, which is, well, you can't find anything better to draw on. And I'm gonna try drawing some stuff on that uh, tonight. I'm not gonna record every drawing I do. I just thought you'd like to see a couple of drawings I did. Now, if you're wondering what I'm talking about, I just uh, posted a video today of me working on a couple of drawings, and uh, I'm doing them for a show I'm going to be doing up in Great Falls uh, the 17th, or is it 18th? I think the 18th through the 20th or the 21st up in Great Falls, Montana at the uh, Heritage Inn. But uh, I talked about it in my video that I just posted on me drawing some pictures. It's windy today. It's because it's, we got a warm front coming through. It's 45 degrees outside. Last week we were in a minus 20 degrees area. So this week it's kind of interesting to have a weather that's spring like. Montana's, there's no place like Montana in the spring, like springtime. The mountains are green, the flowers are growing up in the hills and in the fields, and it's just amazing. On top of the fact it feels good to have warm air for a, <laughs> for a change. I had a weather station remote outside on my uh, back porch ban banister under a piece of wood, you know, kind of in a wood box. The wind got so powerful, it blew the box off with the uh, remote, and I haven't found the remote yet. I bet it ended up in Idaho someplace down south, but uh, we had some strong north winds, just really strong, and uh, it has a tendency to get real powerful and that that's about the most powerful I've had because I've had that remote out there for almost two years now and that wind the other day was just I thought I was gonna lose my roof it was that powerful what I'm doing is just thickening up the uh, body a little bit because it was a little thin and emphasizing the uh, rib cage a little bit as well. I don't know how much of that's going to be showing because he's going to have a blanket on the 
the sat uh, on the back of the horse so a lot of this will probably be covered with that blanket I'm really enjoying working on this horse. And I, I'm kind of excited about the idea of it. Okay, I got just enough time to rough in at least the outline of the neck. And uh, I'll let this uh, soft play stiffen overnight so that I can add uh, the muscles to it and to the shoulders. I got to have the uh, neck at least sketched in before I can start adding muscles to it. That's as far as I'm going to get today. Um, I've got the uh, the beginnings of the horse started now and and I like the way it's looking and tomorrow uh, I'll work on the uh, the rest of the uh, shoulders and uh, like I said I'm just working my way forward on the uh, horse's anatomy and uh, just figured it was time to get the at least to get the neck outlined all right till next time everybody good night have a great evening and I hope it's warm where you are where it's supposed to be warm like down south I hope uh, you people have survived all that and uh, I want you to know I love you all good night please give me a like and a subscribe and ring the little bell also don't forget I have instructional videos available now online the link below this video shows you a link to a review of all nine videos. Later, everybody. Good night.